Hello everyone, here we are again for another session of Seller's Choice Tutorials. In this tutorial, we will learn how to download and use the Browse Tree Guide from Amazon Seller Central. Browse Tree Guide or BTG Tree is required to display your products to a particular branch of Amazon product categories. BTG consists of recommended browse nodes. Recommended browse nodes is the ID of Amazon's category branch. You need to include this in product feed to list your product in a particular category of Amazon. The Browse Tree Guides contain the rules that Amazon.com uses to assign products to browse categories online. In it, you will find mappings between browse categories and Amazon's list of controlled terms which will allow your products to surface in those categories. In this tutorial, we will walk you through how to obtain a BTG for your product category and how to use it. So let's get started. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. So let us download the Browse Tree Guide first. Log into your Seller Central account, that's sellercentral.amazon.com. Once you're in, hover your mouse to the Inventory tab, then select Add Products via Upload on the drop-down. On the Download and Inventory tab, scroll down to the bottom and expand the Inventory file section. Under the File Name column, click the Category Specific Inventory Files link. You'll reach the Inventory Files Templates and BTG. Scroll down to the Release Package Template Versions section and look for the category that matches your product, then click the appropriate BTG or Browse Tree Guide on the Browse Tree Guide column. It will automatically download the Browse Tree Guide. When you open the Browse Tree Guide, you should see the Node ID column, the Node Path, the Query, and the Refinement link. The reason and why you need to use the Browse Tree Guide is for you to get the exact item type keyword which is needed for your product to show up on that certain search category. Item type keywords should be filled exactly as they are written in the BTG all lowercase and separated by hyphens. When selecting an item type keyword, use the most detailed keyword possible as it will inherit all of the attributes of those above it in the same section. There are a couple of techniques in searching the Browse Tree Guide. One is using the Control F or Command F for Mac to search for the category. You can also just scroll along the page and look for that certain category that matches your product. Once you found the category for your product, on the Query column, just copy all the text and the hyphens after the column. Paste this into your inventory file template under the Item Type Keyword column. Then, do this to all of your products if your products have different product types. Going back to the Browse Tree Guide, under the Refinement Link column, there should be a See Available Refinements link. When you click this link, it will highlight the available variation that the product can have. For this example, Oxford Shoes. The variations are size and type. So there you have it. Those are the things that you need to know in using the Browse Tree Guide or the BTG. Just so you know that we have a lot of tutorials and webinars on bits of advice on how to run and the applicable techniques for your e-commerce business. You can always visit our site at sellerschoice.agency and browse through our huge compilations of webinars, tutorials, and blogs. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay tuned. See you soon!